And a very warm welcome back here to the Wing Games, the last day of the Wing Games. Will Penn is with me and another special guest. Who have we got here? Hey, Regan, how's it going? Very well, Will. Uh, that's awesome. I'm here with, uh, with my uh, uh, partner, Allegro Nassi. Hi, welcome. Thank you. Hello. So one of the uh, adverts, one of the sponsors of the event. Tell me a little bit about this project for people. It's what we don't know. Tell us what all about it. Uh, basically, we started a foundation. And uh, within the foundation, we have a fund for the skydiving and uh, base jumping community called the, the Sky Family Fund. And we aim to be there for the community when they need our support, like uh, right after an accident or in the event of a really serious injury or death. Uh, we, we aim to be there to help, uh, to help in those difficult, uh, difficult moments, you know. And where did this idea come from? Well, I think uh, the idea is uh, not really ours. I think it's something that we've all been feeling for, for many years. And uh, just basically, we, we acted on the idea and uh, went through the process, which has taken us the better part of a year to constitute the foundation. And uh, we believe that uh, we believe that we can start to work in a pretty interesting way in, in our in our industry with this with this tool, you know. And once again, I think it's something that many people have felt for a long time, and now we we basically just filling a gap. And we've been in the sport a long time. We uh, we've known many people who've uh, found themselves in a tricky financial situation because of the activities we do. And you're stepping up to the plate now. Is it something which is live? Yes, uh, the foundation has been live for about 10 days now. And uh, actually, on Tuesday this week, we we made the first uh, public launch of the website. So that's uh, Carol Foundation. dot dot uh, org. You can go check that out and see what it's all about. And uh, now. The Wing Games has been very, uh, very accommodating, and they've allowed us to have this uh, space to promote the foundation. And uh, it's the first uh, company in the skydiving industry that's jumped on the train and showed their compassion to work together with the foundation. And I think uh, it's a really great future we have uh, ahead of us with uh, with Window. You know, we can collaborate with all the industry leaders. And uh, once again, we're just very grateful to have this opportunity for the exposure. And uh, this is where, where we both uh, we both live and we fly here every day. So it's a really awesome partnership. And uh, we hope to basically connect the whole industry. You know, it's not something that's just blocked to one um, potential partner or anyone who's associated to my or our activity in the industry. We hope to break down those barriers and do something for the common good of everyone who's involved in our sport. And people watching, if they want to get involved, what's the physical process? How do they get involved? Well, you can go to the website, which, as Will said, is www.careallfoundation.org, and you can donate via the website. You can access us through the Facebook page, um, just mainly online for now. But we'll be we'll be talking soon because we have a bunch of things planned just to push this it's a big privilege to be able to give back to a community that i'm very new in skydiving and in three years i have a huge family and so we're planning on putting a lot of inner energy and giving back and what's the mechanism will let's take me through a scenario somebody gets injured how, how does it work how does it physically work what's the mechanism involved oh, that's a really cool question and i'm glad you brought that up this is something we had to put a lot of time and energy towards just to make sure that we uh, we do things correctly, you know. So basically, once again, the foundation is there. It's a very general mission statement we've created because we hope not to uh, exclude anybody. And then inside that foundation is the Sky Family Fund, and that's towards our community one more time. So. Uh, basically, inside the Sky Family Fund, we have two ways that we can we can reach out and help. It's basically through, uh, very similar to a crowdfunding type of uh, campaign, when we can set up an individual action, let's say. So someone we know personally or, or reaches out to us if we don't have to know them personally, but an individual, let's say, uh, who needs some support, we can create a, a page for them, and then everyone can go to that page or access that page through the website and then help that specific action. But then also on top of that, like we've also created the Sky Family Emergency Fund. And this fund is what, what we feel really strongly about because this fund can be there to help, uh, let's say, in a, in a very open kind of way, anybody who needs the help with some immediate type of relief, you know. Uh, so let's, let's paint a scenario like someone has a really bad uh, accident and uh, their folks need to fly out to be with them just to help them in that moment or their loved one, their wife or whatever it might be. We, we hope to be in a situation where we can send them an immediate uh, transfer of 
uh, an X amount, uh, which will be determined by how much funds we have in the account. And that will be like a symbolic gesture from the foundation and from the community just to help them in those really difficult times because uh, we all know what it's like when, when things go go pear-shaped like the last thing you really want to think about is uh, is the money side you know but we live in a in a world that uh, that revolves around uh, financial needs so we just hope to be there in those moments with some emergency uh, funds that can just take a little bit of uh, the pressure off and show this uh, very collective spirit that that we are creating and our, our community already has this you know we already do these things so again we're not doing anything new. We're just providing a space to be able to do something more together and be ready for these things because that's one more thing that I've seen in, uh, in the sport is that it happens on a pretty much ongoing basis. It's a pretty high risk activity that we're engaged in, you know, so unfortunately it can't really be a surprise when an accident happens and, and when it does happen, it's, it's really powerful to see how everybody gets together and makes a makes a difference and uh, helps in those in those moments but like I think we can be prepared for those scenarios so that when it happens it's like uh, there's no delay you know it's like someone needs some help we can give them some help so we, we aim to be in a position where we can help quite a few people even if let's say a really bad accident happens and the plane goes down like we can help everyone on the plane but once again like this uh, the amount we're gonna be able to help will be directly proportionate to how much funds we have in the account, you know. But we, we launched the, the website on Tuesday and uh, because of the fantastic community we have, we've already uh, broken like 5,000 euro uh, mark and let's say that's without really any campaign. So what we're looking for, just to give you a bit of an idea, if you're watching now and you want to get behind, which is a very worthy cause, just get on the website there and just uh, donate a few dollars and a few euros and a few pounds. And you never know, you could be helping somebody out in their time of need. Just give us a website one more time, Will. That's www.carolfoundation.org. And uh, yeah, keep, keep an eye out for the social media. We're on Facebook and Instagram. We've got all of that stuff going. And, and basically, like the Wind Games has been our first uh, official soft launch. And uh, once again, thanks to Window for making that, that possible. And... Uh, from next week, we're going to start to work on some really interesting uh, fundraising campaigns. And I'm pretty sure you're going to see a lot more of the foundation if, uh, if we have anything to do with it. Like, uh, we're going to be doing our best to make some unselfish acts and uh, bring the community that already is so tightly knit even more together. Well, brilliant. It's a great cause, great people as well. I've known you a very long time. Thank you for putting all this together for us. Thank you, Regan. Thank you guys for helping the ones that have and for helping in the future the ones that will brilliant stuff. We'll be back with more live action here at the finals day of Wing Games 2018 in a couple of minutes. Thank you, Regan.